One of the great features that Equid provides is a full integration with the POS system Square. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your Equid store to your Square account and sync up all of your products, including options, variations, and stock levels. All right, let's get started. If we head over to Sales Channels, Other Channels, and click on POS, click on Connect Square, and you'll be taken to the Square sign-in page. If you have an account, go ahead and sign in and skip ahead in the video to the timestamp on the screen. If you don't have an account, go ahead and sign up. There's some information that you'll need to provide, of course. You'll need your email and you'll need a secure password. You'll select your country, agree to Square's terms, privacy policy, and e-sign-in consent, and click Continue. Square's going to ask you for some basic information about your business. You'll need to provide your legal business name. You'll note if you don't have an official business name, enter the name you want on your receipts. If you have an employee identification number or EIN, you'll put that in here. Estimated revenue, and once again, just fill out the information as you need. Click Continue. You'll need to provide all of the legal information for your entity as well. And once your identification has been verified, you'll be ready to set up how you want to be paid, either next day deposit or same day deposit. Click Continue. Now, now you'll link your bank account. You can, of course, skip for now. And you can request either a Square Reader or a Square Reader for Magstripe. We'll skip that for now as well. So whether you already had an account and signed in, or you just completed the process we went through, this is the next screen that you'll see and the next action that you'll need to take. Square needs to know that you want to interact with your Equid store, so it's asking for your permission. Go ahead and click Allow. Once your store is successfully connected, you'll be brought back to this screen in your Equid store, and you'll be able to sync your inventory and sales with Square. Click Enable Sync, and here's the first decision you'll need to make. Will you be importing your catalog from Square or exporting your catalog to Square? Honestly, this depends on which system was set up first and where your catalog currently resides. So depending on where your catalog is, then you'll choose one of these options. I want to export my catalog to Square because my catalog is in Equid but isn't in my Square account yet. It's just that simple. It's going to take just a few moments and now my products are in sync between Square and Equid. The initial import transfers the following product details. The SKU, name, price, image, description, options with titles and price modifiers, category, and stock. It's incredibly important at this point to note that the SKU is the link between systems. They must be kept in sync your inventory and sales will stay in sync with Square. Whether the purchase was made online or in your brick and mortar store, as long as sync is enabled. This is turned on by default when you created the connection. Here on my Square site, I can click on items and I'll see my entire catalog has been synced with my Equid store, including all of the stock, options, and variations. If you had imported the catalog from Square into your Equid store, all of the products would have been imported from your Square store into Equid. One thing that's really important to note is that inventory will sync automatically for products with matching SKUs between Square and Equid. If you add products in your Equid store or your Square store, you'll need to manually sync your catalog once again. If these products don't exist in the other system, well then the import will automatically bring these products in. If the product already does exist in the other system and the SKU is different, well, you now have a conflict that you'll need to take a look at and determine which product is the correct one. As I mentioned earlier, SKUs are really important in the synchronization between Equid and Square. 
So off camera, I duplicated my casual scarf product and exported my catalog to Square once again. When I go over to my Square dashboard and hit refresh, there's that new product available in my brick and mortar store as well. If I had added the products in my brick and mortar store using Square, well then I would simply just import the catalog from Square and once again, the two systems would be in sync. It's important to note that no matter which way you do the manual sync, your products will need some work to be ready for your store, whether that's online or in your brick and mortar store. You should always check your products after a manual sync. There's one more required step and that's the Square Payment Gateway. To take online payments via Square, I just need to enable it. Lastly, I need to confirm the retail location to match where the online sales and inventory sync will occur. If I click change location, I'm able to choose any of the physical stores from my Square account. If I only have one physical location in Square, well then this is already selected for me. But if I have multiple locations in Square, I need to choose the appropriate physical location that the inventory and sales will be synced to. So over here in Square, I have two physical locations and I can choose either one of these to sync to in my Equit account. The last thing you might want to do if you have a physical store is head to shipping and pickup and add a self pickup option. If you have multiple brick and mortar locations and want to offer pickup options to your online customers, you can create a self pickup method and specify a store location for each pickup option. To do that, click add pickup. I can put the detailed instructions for customers, a pickup charge if there is one. I can even ask for a pickup time and date at checkout. Under the store location section, I'll select the location I want to assign this pickup method to. If I do offer curbside or drive through pickup instead of regular in-store pickup, I can update the label here with the detailed instructions to reflect that. Of course, I can add as many self pickup locations as I have brick and mortar stores. Simply click add pickup, select the store, configure any other options I need and click add pickup option. Now when the customer chooses the self pickup option on checkout, they can choose the location at which they want to pick their order up. The order will then be processed by the physical location and the customer can pick it up there, giving them maximum flexibility. Equid and Square are completely synchronized. So when I make a sale in my brick and mortar store, my Equid inventory is updated. And when someone makes an online purchase, everything will be synced back to Square. Equid and Square working together to keep your online and physical sales completely in sync.